Hi everyone, and I am back with some things that I bought yesterday at Walmart. Um, so you'll notice that one of them is Calico Critters. It was the only box there, and I'm hoping everything's there because I did note that one side of the tape was broken. So I'm, I'm hoping everything is in the box. And this is part of a new set um, by Honeybee Acres, and it's uh, Rainbow Ridge, uh, apparently a new, I guess, line. Um, and this is Crystal's Ice Cream Shop. I was looking forward to being able to purchase it directly in store, as I, I really wanted to see the item first before buying it, rather than buying it online. And to my surprise, they had they had it in store. And they had this one in store as well. This is the Sunburst Art Studio, also part of Rainbow Ridge. And uh, both sets bring critters. So um, I will open them up and um, I'll be back after to show you the, uh, the toys. Okay, so I've taken the ice cream shop out of the box. And here we have Crystal, the critter, very cute. I like that she's able to stand up on her own. Um, so one thing I did notice as far as the flooring, not crazy about this, it's just a little piece of cardboard to make it look like it's uh, got a sprinkles floor. So not crazy about that, but otherwise I do like the toy. I like the, uh, the lights here shaped in uh, the form of ice cream cones. I like the stained glass look. There we go. There's one, two, and three windows. Stained glass windows. I do like the, the cute embellishments here on the, uh, the toy. The flowers here. And on the side here, oh, and here's two more right here. Very cute. There actually is one more right over here that you can see. It's got a cute little sign in the shape of an ice cream cone. Um, and it does have a lot of embellishments. So here are all the um, extras. The extra pieces, the ice creams, ice cream cones, etc. There's a blender. Um, so here is a display case. And here is where the different um, toppers go. And it comes with two cute little chairs. They're really small, but they are cute. So I am going to put all, take out the uh, pieces and see exactly what we've got. Let's see, so this, uh, it's a, like a banana float, very cute. Uh, let's see, and another one. So here is, whoops, the actual blender. Not sure where I'm going to put that. <laughs> I'll have to figure everything out. Let's see what else they've got here. So here are the different dishes to put the ice cream sundae in. So I'm going to go ahead and I will put an ice cream sundae in one ice cream sundae in the other one. All right, so there's the ice cream sundaes. Well, I have everything set up now and I'll show you what I did. So here in the back, you can see that the ice cream cones um, are set up and uh, there are four little holes that you can put the ice cream cones in. And um, so the cones are separate. So I just randomly selected 
what I would top the cone with. And we've got some more cones in here, plus some ice cream. And then here are some syrups, chocolate, and uh, I guess that would be strawberry. I filled this with the toppers. This does spin. See, that does spin around. And, um, and these in the back, I'm not sure if those are meant to be like candy dishes. So there is one complaint that I do have about this. Sorry, this fell off here. And that um, here on the side, you'll notice these barely fit on here. I was, I was barely able to fit two on the top. Um, can't really do that with the bottom shelf. And it just seems like the photo displays a larger shelf. I don't know if that's my imagination, but that's what it looks like to me. So I'm going to show you the box. So here's the box. And that, this to me, uh, sorry, <laughs> right here, you can see that two easily fit on the bottom and that is not possible with the one that I have. Um, this does display the right size here, but definitely not here. The shelves I have in this are smaller. But other than that, it is a really cute toy. There is absolutely one thing I forgot. So I see here on the box, apparently there is a chandelier. So let's check that out. Can barely, ah, there it is. There's the chandelier, very cute. So overall, I do think it's a cute toy. Um, I like the, uh, the rainbow colors and um, the fantasy look of it. I think it would look great with, for example, the amusement park. Um, I'm going to try to see how I could fit something like this there because I think that would be a good place for it. Anyways, I will open up the next item and share with you in a moment. So here is the Sunburst Art Studio. And let me go through the pieces that it comes with. So here is Opal. And Opal, I believe, is a flying horse. Um, I'm figuring that because of the, the horse's mane. It's got some wings, is hooved, and can stand up on her own once in a while. I think I've got her pretty much leaning against the toy right now. It comes with 12 sheets of stained glass plastic. And then you can just arrange them in the windows um, to your liking. This is a hammock. And this goes over here. Like this. Let's see if I can reach over to get it to the other side. Okay, it's been a little difficult. There we go. Okay, I'll fix that in a minute, but uh, that is where the hammock is supposed to go. I don't think I'm supposed to bend this because it's plastic and it could break. I may need to remove it, we'll see. Anyways, uh, there is one thing that I do like about this, and this is the oven. And look, it has a light in there. I already put two pieces of pottery inside the oven and they are currently baking. So this goes on top of the studio. This is part of a sign that goes out in the front. Um, so here is, uh, I don't know what it's called, but it's for when a person's going to uh, shape pottery and I put a piece of pottery on there. Of course, when I say pottery, it's not real pottery. It's all plastic. Um, it comes with the sink. And here would be a, a stand. Here is a, a painting. So I'll just put that on there. There we go. It comes with, uh, it's got two, it's got one chair and two 
little stools here, very cute, and also a tree stump, which I think also acts as a stool. And this is for hanging up the sign. And here's some other pieces. So I am going to uh, set it all up and we'll take a look afterwards. So here is the art studio. All of the pieces are out. As you can see on the right, on the top there, um, there is a place to hang the uh, easel when a person is painting. There's a place here to be able to put um, paint brushes and there's a little tiny pair of scissors in there. And then here is the, um, the tree stump that is also um, being used as a chair or a stool. And then down here, so these shelves will be where the paint, the, the tiny little paint jars will go. And there I've placed the, the potted plant. There's a stool and a little chair. These in the sink here. These actually open. There we go. Probably could put stuff down there as well. Over here, I've set up the um, place for making pottery with a little stool. And I put some pottery there on the shelf. Again, it's not real pottery, it's just plastic. Um, so there is one thing that I would not have known if the box hadn't told me. So apparently this chandelier lights up. There is a button right here on the top that you would press and the chandelier lights up very pretty. Uh, you can see all the stained glass now. Um, the stained glass windows are now uh, set up. So there is a slot where you just slide it in I really think this is cute here, all of this embellishment right here. It's not just, you know, painted on, they're actually, you know, they're embellishments. And here we've got the door to come in. And of course you choose where you want to put what as far as the um, stained glass. There's some more embellishment here. And this is the art studio. And with the one character that it brings. And that's it. I've got one more item to open and uh, I'll be back for that. Here is the sky blue terrace gift set. And I did confirm that it came with all the pieces, so that was great news for me. The two characters, apparently, I thought at first they might be Elwood, but they are actually Bubble Brook. And so Mama is Ryan, and the baby's name is Hilton.